Hello, I'm James, and this is a Jonesing for Film Theatrical Review. Yes, Sherlock Holmes, A Game of Shadows. Not A Game of Thrones, that's something else entirely. So this film picks up after the first film. Sherlock is hunting down his greatest adversary to date, Professor James Moriarty. Accompanying him is his trusted partner Watson and a gypsy woman who's trying to find her missing brother. Now I personally love the first film. And one of my biggest fears with all sequels is that they might not keep what was best about the original, or they might stay too close to the original to the point where it's hard to differentiate between the two. Neither of these fears is the case with Game of Shadows. Here they kept everything that worked about the first film and expanded on it. The action here is so much bigger than the first. The writing is sharper. The banter between Watson and Holmes is quicker and funnier. The relationship between Watson and Holmes is much stronger than the first. And it was pretty strong in the first. And the biggest upgrade is the villain and the crimes he commits. Jared Harris makes a great villain. And he is so much more threatening than Mark Strong's Lord Blackwood from the first film. Also a nice addition to the cast is Swedish actor Numi Rapace. I haven't seen any of her other films, but she seems to be a great actress. But just like Rachel McAdams in the first one, she's a little underused here. Also a new addition to the cast is Stephen Fry as Sherlock's brother, Mycroft. He had a couple of very humorous scenes, and he was also a welcome addition to the cast. Now, as I mentioned earlier, the action has been stepped up from the first movie. Stakes are much higher, and therefore the action scenes are much more intense. Slow motion has been added to certain scenes, but they are used very well and they add to the intensity rather than just being a cheap gimmick. And once again, Hans Zimmer's score does not disappoint. My one small gripe with this film compared to the first is the climax. While this climax is very entertaining, it was not as, for lack of a better word, action-y as its predecessor. With the one-on-one -on -one showdown, punch-for-punch -punch sort of fight at the end of the first being so intense, I figured the intensity to this climax would be pushed to the next level. But instead, it was slightly calmer than some of the other action scenes before it. And I'm not saying I didn't enjoy it, it was very entertaining. I just felt that the two climaxes have been swapped. This should have been the climax for the first movie, and then the more intense one should have been for the, this movie. So in the end, if you enjoyed the first Sherlock Holmes, then you will definitely enjoy this one. I give it a superb, a very entertaining film for the holiday season. So that was my review of Sherlock Holmes, A Game of Shadows. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to subscribe. Also, don't forget to visit me on Facebook. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in my next review.